Hey guys, it's Renee. So today I thought I would share with you how to make earrings out of necklaces. Keep in mind you're going to be not destroying them completely, but just changing their shape a little bit. So keep that in mind. To make this, we need some sort of charms or pendants or anything that's hanging or any shape. And in here I have two. One that is like more statement and the other one that is like more delicate and intricate. For both, it's pretty much going to be the same concept because they're both like structured in the same way. So we have a chain and then like the charms or pendants all across it and then the chain again so for this we're going to be using a couple of pliers so yeah it's a matter of like opening those jump rings with the pliers removing the charm in my case i have two jump rings that i have to open on both sides of my charms then just removing the flowers And in my case, these flowers have those loops where the charm was. I'm going to remove them by cutting this. And then because this is kind of like metal, I went with my nail file and just made everything smooth. If you have to change things a little bit like I did here, you can always use nail polish or just acrylic paint if you need to. And then I use these ear wires, opening that with my pliers, placing like my flower in there, and then just close it. This is going to depend on like the charm that you are left with. Mine was easy because this is like a hollow flower, but you may need to use eye pins, jump rings, or anything like that. And yeah, this is pretty much what the end result of this one looks like. As you can see, I didn't lose the essence of this because the necklace still looks like it is, like gorgeous and just statement still. But now I have the earrings just in case I don't want to go for the necklace. This one is a bit more more delicate well a lot more delicate it used to be my grandma's it's vintage like an actual vintage one so if i break this i break this <laughs> but the reason i decided to go for this is because i really like those daisies but i don't wear the necklace that often i'm gonna be pretty much doing the same thing again this is a lot more delicate and intricate because now i have instead of like just one jump ring i have two on each side of like those charms so i just have to be really careful working with one step at a time it took me a bit longer because of the size of those jump rings once i have done that and open those jump rings then closing them and just removing the charm i'm going to be doing the same thing as far as like the ear wire placing that with my pliers and this is what it looks like as you can see the necklace it almost looks like intact because i just removed one daisy it didn't lose the essence of it i wanted this earrings to be more subtle more delicate even and now it's pretty much like the other case whenever i don't want to go for the full necklace but i want this design i can just rock the earrings if you have a necklace that you like but you don't really use that much because it's heavy maybe too big or just you don't want to really use it but you like something about it maybe this is a good way to just preserve the necklace in a different way or you can create your own sets out of necklaces that have like extra charms on them i really hope this was helpful handy and you liked it if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up check out more accessories that i have on my channel and subscribe for more let me know what you think of this one and share this thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care bye